Hey there guys, Falafel here to welcome back to Life on the Rock, New Island. Jay Hicko right here. So on today's video, we're just going to have coconut and crackers for snack. Then I'm just going to show you what it is. It's a pretty popular snack here on, on New Way. Around our house, we have heaps of coconut trees. You can see one there behind me. A lot of coconuts on it. On different, different heights. Uh, lucky I don't have to climb the coconut tree. Too old for that. Hey, there's another coconut tree. That one there is pretty tall. There's another coconut tree there, and we have a we have a coconut tree here, and then we have this pole with a hook at the end. We call it a seca. See, that's the hook, and we use that to pull the coconuts down. The drinking coconuts but today I'm choosing I'm um, grabbing some coconuts from this coconut tree instead because it's much much shorter so that bunch there they look pretty decent but if you can see on this side here I have this pole or another short sack attached to it that I will just come and use for this yes so there it is on the ground the first coconut Yep, so I'm just gonna grab another one. There we go. Here it is. Perfect. You can also tell how good the coconut is by its weight. If it's much, much older, the coconut will be much lighter than this one. So here we go. Oh, there we go. Managed to clean up these two coconuts a little bit. And they're not as perfect like how I wanted them to be. See, as you can tell on the ends there, a lot of brown on it. Same on this one here, which means that the meat inside is gonna be a little more firm. Man, I've been out here for about 30 minutes and it's Super hot already. Hot. Hot day. I'm going to prepare these coconuts. I'm just going to crack the top open here. And just leave a big space here where you can fit your spoon in to scoop out the flesh and the crackers once you're done with it. So, just going around it. coconut water oh yeah we failed because I spilled some of it quite a lot in there that's my first one so the second one hopefully we better than the first, how it did the first one. So, open it up. Yeah. That's all of it in there. Spilled quite a bit too, which is no good. I just gotta go put all of this in the fridge, in the refrigerator, keep it nice and cold. What you do with the coconut here is you just scrape the meat. 
See, like I told you, the sides here, the meat is pretty thick. Preferably the coconuts would have been done yesterday, put it in the fridge overnight so it'll be nice and chilled and in the morning you just wake up, open it up like this, put the juice aside, sometimes you don't have to, sometimes people will just open the coconut up and break the crackers into it and then dig into it but somehow I like it when the coconut water is cold, nice and cold so I just chill mine because this one is not that chilled because it's straight from the coconut tree like you saw before so that's why i'm chilling it now now we're just gonna wait for the coconut water waiting for it to get chilled and then we'll bring it here then we'll enjoy i'm gonna take this and chill it too the lid for the second one there we go all right here we go so we're just gonna have our pepe new breakfast or brunch or lunch of the champions they say here on new way yeah. already done <laughs> yeah don't have to do any work so now just scooping back some coconut meat that i that I scraped that before. Oh, I might have a bit too much. Leave some for Sema. And, oh, this is nice and cold, nice and chilled now. Look at it. Oh. Man, the crackers. This is my favorite crackers to use for the pepe new. Other people like some other type of crackers. But um, value cream crackers. Cream crackers, yes. You can use breakfast crackers or any other type of crackers. But I like these ones for some reason. Yeah, so you can just break them up. And depending on you, some people like their crackers to be all soggy. Or uh, not as soggy, but still have a little bit of a crunch when you bite it. Mix that together with some coconut meat. Oh. Oh, that one's not having any crackers in here. No, I am. I don't know if you could tell, but it's a really, really hot day. And it's really nice to have a really cold coconut. Oh, it's really yum. That's yum. Ooh, I'm going to dig into this. Check that out. Okay. That's what I'm talking about. Well, mate. Hmm. Beautiful. been better with the coconut water all nice and chilled hmm. like I mentioned before our coconuts have a little bit over the over matured side See, check that out mm. it doesn't make it any less yummy it's all really yummy with all these 
white coconut flesh. inside yeah there it is and also around the house with the coconut trees we pretty much have a fair idea now because not all coconuts are the same taste wise size wise even the husks so around the house now we pretty much have a fair idea of which coconuts are really really sweet which coconuts have the husks that are really easy to husk when you husk them so you can just get this coconut here some of the ones some of the coconut trees here produce coconuts that are like the husk are really difficult to husk so i try to avoid husking those ones i just use the bush knife to chop it open very nice and if you didn't know, the green coconuts are much harder to husk than the brown coconuts. The husk um, come off easily on the brown ones, and I find it easier to husk the brown one. I remember when I was younger, the, um, having snacks like this at the bush, you know, waking up early, heading off to the bush, these coconuts, just grab a crack up. Couldn't wait for my parents to be hot, so then I know that's when they come for their coconut. That's when we have breakfast. As always, coconut and cream crackers. So yum. Even yummy when you're hungry and hot. Like, like right now. Mm. Get some good stuff. I guess this also kind of depends on the coconut that you're using. If the coconut is nice and sweet, oh, this will make this experience even better. But if it's not sweet, kind of like waste of time. If you have an opportunity, if you're on holiday to the islands or you can grab a coconut like this, the just green have a one. go. The green, green coconut, one. not yes. the dried brown one. Not the brown coconuts, the drinking coconuts. And try it and see how you like it. I reckon restaurants over here or takeaways, they should have this on their menu. I'll buy it. Some people are, I've seen some people have these with like a kind of like a fruit salad. They put fruits inside like papua, new tupu, and they eat it with the crackers and the coconut. I haven't tried it though, but it looks yum. Mm -hmm. There we go. Haven't finished, but I'm starting to feel full now. Maybe, maybe. Having a refill. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh, yeah, you know what else? They, they have FAMU New Days at school now and it's really cool. The kids just take a coconut and a spoon and I think the teachers provide the crackers and they have FAMU New Day. A good healthy snack, I think. Anyway, people, thank you for being with us on our video today. 
Death on the Rock, New Island. So you go right here and Shanta, Shanda. Cameraman, producer. That's Emma here on the side. Thank you for checking out our videos and uh, we're looking forward to catch up with you again and hopefully you'll tune in to more videos in the future. Check out our channel and please, if you haven't subscribed, do so. Tap out our little channel and subscribe. Take care and see you on the next episode. Peace. Cheers.